την σκάρα, Νέχο. Έστι It's good you're here. Is it? Look around you. Athens is dying. What do you think is going on? I don't know. What I do know is that it kills without discrimination. Rich, poor, philosopher or farmer. And I'm helpless to stop it. What's happening to the victims? Leaking, postulant rashes, raging fevers, pallid, sweaty skin. I find many dying in their own excrement. Is there nothing that can be done? I try and ease the suffering where I can. The plague is spreading through the victim's excretions. I'm sure of it. The bodies must be burned. Your compassion for the people has always inspired me. Unfortunately, compassion is all I have to give. The gods have shown me how arrogant I had become. We're only mortal. And the gods like to remind us whenever they can. I need help burning the bodies, Alexios. Fanatics are roaming the streets trying to stop me in my work. What fanatics? The followers of Ares. Superstitious fools. They believe burning the dead is sacrilege and attacked me. Can you believe it? These followers of Ares don't worry me. I'll help burn the bodies. <coughs> Athens is but a shade of what it was. Reach Hades safely. Another body safe from the fanatics. That's all of them. You're back. Got to run, sorry. Wait, where? I'll be right back. See you at Aspasias. Sometimes I think you are too much like me. I know you're angry, and you have the right to be. Why do they hide in there? Aspasia. Oh, Alexios, you've returned to Athens. What's left of Athens, the world we've built is crumbling at our feet. It's bleak, but it hasn't killed you. You're right. But everything Pericles has built is being destroyed. It's chaos outside these walls. People have forgotten how to be people. I came to talk to you. I found out some things about my mother. 
Her name, her ship. Alexios, it's not the time. Pericles is dying. He won't see me. He won't let Hippocrates in his room. He only babbles about going to his precious Parthenon. Pericles is a strong man. I'm sure he can fight this sickness. You heard the mob. He can't defend himself. He'll die with no glory. Athens has known him a lot longer than they've known this plague. He gave them a voice. His accomplishments will speak for him. <sighs> Pericles needs treatment, and the gods know he won't let me in. He respects you. Could you go to him? I could try. If you do, I will make the time to talk about your mother. For now, he needs your help. It's worth a shot. Alexios. Yes. Come in. It's embarrassing. Someone so strong seeing me like this. You look healthy as ever. Tell Aspasia that. She won't worry so much about me. I brought your drugs. Ah, yes. It's usually Phoebe who does the delivering. At least I'm alive. Though I can't say the same for my city. It's a shadow of what it was. Well, it will belong to Cleon now. He will have to lift it out of its sorry state. I wish to see it with my own eyes. Come to the balcony. Much has changed. I can't even stand up straight to look death in the eye. You'll recover sooner if you let Hippocrates see you. It's my time. The plague chooses is no favorites. I fear I've failed Athens. Its people? Aspasia? No, you haven't. Ah, you're kind, but I've lost. Aspasia needs protection, as does Athens. I thought I gave enough to Athena. But it seems it isn't so. I should be out there, on the streets. You'd be overtaken. There are mobs, and Cleon's doing nothing to calm them. Thank the gods, Cleon won't see me like this. But that's all I can thank the gods for. They've turned on me. It's not the gods' fault. It's the world. It's turned upside down. Athens' fate is decreed. All we can do now is wait. You should go back inside. You need to rest. Where I should be is in the Parthenon. My greatest legacy to Athens. We need the gods' blessing. But Aspasia... Aspasia's right. She often is. But not about this. Yes. I'll go inside. Thank you, Alexios. Tell my Aspasia I was a good boy and took my drugs. I will. Pericles let me in. He took his drugs without complaint. Thank you. Something wrong? I expected Phoebe back by now. I saw her in the crowds outside. Did you send her somewhere? I had her go to Anastasios to see about a ferry. As soon as Pericles is strong enough, we're leaving Athens. We have to. But now she's missing. I'm sure she's all right. Aspasia, there's a plague. You've seen the streets. She's just a child. Give her the credit she deserves. She's more of a fighter than I was at her age. I told Pericles the cult is in Athens. It's too dangerous. The cult? I thought it was the sickness talking. I'm going to look for her. Where is Anastasios' house? It's across from the Odeon of Pericles. Here.
By the gods. What happened here? I'm glad Phoebe wasn't here. Hopefully she's safe. Limos must be carrying through on her threat. This was savage. Done to send a message. Alexios! Are you all right? I need to speak to Aspasia. We must find Pericles first. He's missing. I don't fucking care! Tell me where Aspasia is! Alexios! <sighs> I'm sorry, Phoebe. Aspasia went to find Pericles at the Parthenon. She should be there. I think we'd better go with him. I agree, my friend, I agree. There you are, Alexios. Quickly, Pericles may be inside. What's gotten into you? Phoebe was killed by cult guards before I could get to her. Oh, no. Dear Phoebe. She died alone in the street. No, you found her. She wasn't alone. I know how much of a friend she was to you. I won't let them get away with this. You have to fight. For her. Aspasia, you're here. Any sign of Pericles? If he's here, he's inside praying. He refused to stay safe in the villa. Things have gotten even worse in the Agora. It's madness. Speak later and act now. Pericles... Go! Please. 
Stay out of my way. You're mine! is lost now. He was a great man. Perhaps greater than we even knew. We need to get her out of Athens. We'll take my ship. We have to leave. Don't let him die in vain. Never. Move quickly. Stay close, just in case. I'm growing. Stop! Cleon has ordered that no one leave Athens. And he wants Aspasia brought to him. I'm not going. Leave. Don't let them go. Come here. Clear now. Let's go. We're going to stay, Alexios. What? Why? My work is here. I can't leave the Athenians in the state they're in. You don't need us to protect Aspasia. Leave Athens to us. You saw what happened to Pericles. You want the same to happen to you? If every dissenting voice disappears, the people won't turn against him. They need me here. You're sure? I have lived as an Athenian, and I will die as an Athenian. Then do something for me. Both of you. Of course. Retrieve Phoebe's body. Give her a proper burial. Everything she deserves, and more. Thank you. Time to go, Alexios. I expect to see you both again, alive. The farther we get from Athens, the quieter it grows, as though it's peaceful. But I know better. I'm sorry, Aspasia. About Pericles and Athens. You have no need to apologize for anything. It feels like 
I let everyone down. I didn't get to them quick enough. Didn't make the right decisions. It's not your fault. There's no one to blame but the cult of Cosmos. I'll make each of them beg for mercy before I kill them. That time will come. For now, let us look to the future. Do you have a heading? I was hoping you would help me with that. Yes, of course. This woman. Finicas. Her ship was called Siren Song. Finicas. Yes, I know the name. Last anyone heard, her ship was docked on the island of Naxos. Uh, then we go to Naxos to see Finicas. that volcano? It's pretty hard to miss. Some say there is an entrance to the underworld at the bottom. And what? You enter by diving in it? That's the spirit! A brave Arcadian I once knew had... Same idea. And what happened to him? The heat of the flames turned him to ashes before he made it halfway down. I guess some mysteries are best left. Dangerous waters, Commander. Your heartbeat is as loud as the sea itself. We're approaching Narcos. Are you excited? Nervous. What will I say to her? Alexios, you've traveled half the Greek world to find her. You don't have to say anything. Just being there will be enough. But what if she... ...is disappointed in me? mother would want a child as brave and as loyal as you. If I were your mother, I would be the nervous one. You think so? I know so. Now go and find her. You waited long enough for this. <clears throat> Don't do anything. I won't be intimidated. Stock the barracks and double the patrols. If Paros is sending them, I want to know the moment they make landfall. Yes, Archon. But Archon, please, Cercis. the merchants have... I understand your concerns. But protecting the town and the quarries is what's most important. You may all go. Meeting is over. Alexios. How? When I closed my eyes, I could still see you falling. I thought I had lost you. Sander is still alive. They have her, don't they? I rebuilt my life from ashes. Do you understand? And now you tell me you're alive. to get her back. She's too far gone. I gave up on you both once. Never again. What have How you... How did you... I have a lot of questions. 
I think we both do. But ask. I'll answer what I can. I want to know about my real father. How did you know? I was told. Nikolaos, you saw him? In Megaris, yes. Nikolaos was your father. He was the man who raised you. Until he took his Spartan duty too far. He mentioned another. What can you tell me about him? I always hoped you would never need to discover the truth. But there are things you need to know if we are to stop the cult. What do you mean? He sought me out before I knew your fa- Nikolaos. I've not heard from him in a long time. What's wrong? Soldiers from Paros just made landfall in the cove. A small force, maybe a dozen. Malaka. Timo, gather the troops. Questions will have to wait, Lam. I want to help. I assume you can use those weapons? Better than when you last saw me. Good. Come. Who is attacking? Paros, across the bay. It seems Silanos has finally grown tired of sharing the marble trade. Why now? We've always had problems with Paros. I expected that attack, just not so soon. I guess the time for talking is over. <laughs> Allies often forget their allegiances when opportunity beckons. Why are you working with Sparta, given all that's happened? Paros made an alliance with the Athenians, so they left me little choice. You needed support. A rivalry with Paros is one thing, but they turned it into a war. Their partnership with Athens was too much to weather for Naxos. There's always been a rivalry between the islands. After all, Naxos used to control Paros and Andros. They're envious of our craftsmen, too. And now? They think they deserve expansion. Their oligarch demands their wings spread wide. But we'll clip their wings before that happens. They don't know who they're up against. You remind me of Nikolaos. You fight just like him. Ruthless and cunning. He would be proud. The real world taught me better. When someone wants your head, you have to learn to save your neck. I know exactly what you mean. What happened to you in Argolis after that night? I found your sister and rushed to a young doctor's apprentice, Hippocrates. I thought I'd lost you. I wasn't ready to lose you both. I spoke with him recently. That night still haunts him. I was heartbroken when the healers in Asclepios told me Cassandra was dead. The two of you were my whole world. But she did live. 
They lied to you. They must have realized she was special and handed her over to the cult. She's been brainwashed. She believes she's doing what's right. Some have successfully abandoned the cult. We could bring her back. We owe it to her to try. I don't understand why the cult targeted our family. There are many reasons, Lam. What did we ever do to them? Now that we're reunited, it's more a question of what we could do to them. They fear us. Your ancestors have been a thorn in their side for generations. They've decided we need to be eliminated to ensure their plans come to fruition. The cult will pay for all they've done to our family and the Greek world. You are mighty, Lam, but you cannot defeat that beast with sword and spear alone. I'll use any weapon I can to make them suffer as we have. I know you left Sparta, but how did you end up on this island? I couldn't stand by Nikolaos after what he did. I had to get out of Sparta. So why here? I saw an opportunity to help people, to grow something. I was elected to rule and protect this island from those who would ruin what we've built. You've done some incredible things. Naxos is lucky to have you as its leader. It's not been without its difficulties, but I'm proud of what we've achieved. It's a pity there aren't more leaders like you. Let's continue this discussion somewhere the smell of death doesn't linger. Ride with me. Sparta has nothing on Naxian beaches. Sparta. All I remember is the bottom of Mount Aigetos. When I brought you to the Pythia as a baby, she never said we would live a nightmare. She said you had such promise. The Pythia can predict everything. Your general acted quickly, ringing the alarm. Timo knows Paris is a threat. They make their business clear. They can't be more clear than sending soldiers. There's no treaty? Maybe there was, but it's long over. Now there's no mistaking them for anything but the enemy. An enemy I could help you defeat. We'll discuss that later. But I think you're right. Ella! <laughs> Paros must be stopped. The temple's coming along, Evandros. It will stay in ruins if we don't secure more donations. Soldiers can't get all the funds. They can if you don't want the temple destroyed by our enemy. But I'll see what I can do. It's a good deed restarting construction. Ligdamis was a great man who deserves reverence. His battles against corruption and oligarchy are lessons we all should remember. I do intend to finish the temple. Thank you, Phoenix. What a strange day it has been. But a good one. I've certainly had worse. Me too. You have grown into a remarkable man, but I see the burden you carry on your shoulders. Finding you has lessened it, I think. I'm glad, but I have wondered why the gods chose to reunite us now. So we can destroy the cult once and for all. If only it were that simple. You are mighty, but we cannot stop them alone. They are the source of all our pain, and they will cause more to many others unless we act. I put that life behind me the moment I left Sparta. I have Naxos to worry about now. Let me help you here. We can safeguard Naxos, and then hunt down the cult together. 
Mirini, the symposium is about to start. By the gods. I'm sorry, my sweet. I forgot. Prepare the horses. I'll be out shortly. The symposium? I need to show the people their leader is strong and in control. Sometimes the face we show to the world needs to be one of strength, despite the chaos we harbor beneath. I will help you stop the cult. But before I can leave Naxos, I have to ensure it will survive without me. What do you need? Paros has to be dealt with. We need to weaken their position. Once they're vulnerable, they will make a reckless decision and we will strike. What did you have in mind? We must force the Paros fleet to engage us and destroy it. But my Admiral Aeneas is missing. His ship was sailing for Paros to engage in peace talks, and he never returned. Don't worry. I'll find him. If you need me, I'll be at the symposium. Although, try to look less intimidating should you choose to pay me a visit.